jelly beans. This what we had it for dinner. Honey farm is up for kibaki and some whole fresh fries. So that's what we're having for dinner. I'll be back. Oh, and we also got it out hot dog bodies. Yeah. All right, jelly beans. Look at him. This how the dinner turned out. It's mine's. Honey got cheese and relish and mustard on his. I just got mustard on mine's. All right. I'll see y'all tomorrow. Good morning, good morning, jelly beans. Um, I'm here cleaning out the car. I did this side the best that I could. But this is how it is looking, and I just can't take it. I told Honey for now on he was going to be the one cleaning out the car, but he hasn't gotten around to it yet. So I'm just going to go ahead on and do it. That's how the back and stuff is looking. And um, yeah, so that's what I'm doing. I'm at um, Bridget's appointment. Her appointment right now. So while she in there, her appointment, I'm just in here uh, vacuuming. Get in the car. Clinked out the best I can, so. That's what I'm doing. Cause I just I can't I can't take this. Wait a minute. can't really um you know like hold the thing if y'all so wait a minute all right jelly beans i can turn this <laughs> car off now because i don't be um wait a minute i gotta sit down Whew. I got the floors as clean as I can get those and back there I got it as clean as I can get it so yeah all right Charlie Bing so I got that Let's see. as clean as I can um get that I guess y'all like but I could turn the car off because when I'm running and I'm glad it's is cool out here the wind blowing so it ain't um you know all super hot but um yeah I just got tired of the car looking like being like that and like I said, honey's supposed to have to be the one cleaning the car for now and on, but I don't know, guys. It's just like if I don't make the initiative to do something, it's like it is is not going to get done. Wait a minute. Yeah, it's like it's just not going to get done. 
and not to be, you know, I'm just keeping it real with y'all. It's not, if I don't usually when a car, when we, when y'all see the car being clean, it's because I'm the one that got out there and started cleaning the car first. And even if I'm cleaning the car, honey, you know, sometimes we'll just still be sitting up on the porch with mom or something like that. And I just tell him, just wait and let me, um, you know, vacuum or something like that because he always holler about he can't vacuum, he can't uh, do it right or it don't be coming up with him. I said, it do. It's just that it's a car vacuum cleaner. So you have to constantly, you know, empty the thing out so it can pick up the dirt. You just got to clean, you know, clean, dump the thing out. Dump the, the, the trash out. So he always acting like he can't do this or do that and stuff. And, and it's just frustrating. So that's how that be going. And that's how come. The only time the car get clean is if uh take I'm trying to get this up I just vacuumed all right here so the only time the car really get cleaned is if um is if from if I make the initiative to clean the car and that's just how that goes if I don't make the initiative to clean the car, then the car just won't get clean. I think that's the one I had in there. So yeah, guys, that's, that's how that be going. Because if I didn't wipe this car down, and then when I, when he sit at the car clean, he'd be, baby, I was going to, I was going to do it. Why'd you clean the car? What would? You kept saying you was going to do it. What you mean why I cleaned the car? I cleaned the car because the car needs to be cleaned. And he know that's how I am. He know I'm going to go hit on and, and, and do it. And that's what frustrates me. Because he'll sit and, hold and wait and wait. Because he know that I'm going to go hit on and do it. Because my OCD ain't going to sit there and let me just you know drive around with the with the car being dirty like that and I tried my best to hold out and hold out and kept asking him and kept asking him you know and which a couple of days ago he wasn't feeling good like last week I do know that but even when you started feeling better you, he just ain't clean the car so that's that on that That's how that goes. And like I said, if I don't if I don't clean it, it won't get clean. Or well, you won't see us. Um and I'm just trying to do the bare minimum, y'all. I don't feel like getting up, going all the way around this other side. It's crazy. Oh my goodness. Wait a minute, guys. I'll be back. Oh. All right, guys. I just, I keep the Febreze in the car. The pet odor, yeah, pet odor eliminator. So I usually have to finish spray this all over everything. Oh. I don't have no more um, these in the glove compartment. I thought I had. Nope.
I thought I had um another one, but I don't. Wait a minute. <laughs> That's all done. I keep forgetting we keep these um uh, paper towels in here. <laughs> I was laughing and talking with the the guy that was parked next to me. <laughs> he told his dad, he said, How much you pay for them hearing aids again? And he said, Oh, he said, I cost you a pretty penny. He said, was it worth it? And his father was like, huh? Huh? He said, huh? Huh? And started laughing. I was cracking up. Oh. All right, I'm glad that's out the way. The car nice, fresh smelling. Put some chapstick. On these lips. Oh, let me let y'all. Oh, I go the thing when I act stupid. Wait a minute. So this is how the car is looking. All nice and clean. And yeah. Yeah, so, oh, I don't want to take this thing off my head. And I keep saying I got to get my, cut my hair. I guess I'll do that today. I wanted to clean the, um, the bottom part of the refrigerator is already cleaned out. I forgot to record that last night. So today I'm going to do the top part, which is the freezer part and go through that and stuff and um i do this once a month i clean my refrigerator once a month let comment down below let me know how often you guys clean your refrigerator out i do ours once a month and i'm gonna start recording that too and um also that's the way that i can go through the freezer and see what's still like a little bit of something might have been sitting there from three months ago wrapped in learning a fool like i'm thinking that we got two fish squares that I got wrapped in aluminum foil that we had like four months ago. So I know that's like freezer burnt. So stuff like that I'll, you know, throw out, you know, because I know it ain't no good. So that's why I go through once a month and um try to stay on top of stuff like that so it wouldn't be and that's something that some stuff I got out the deep freezer because when we go to the market and meets and stuff, I take everything out the deep freezer and put the the new stuff in there and then put the other stuff on top so it's rotating so lord stuff that's wrapped up or something might have a box it only got two pieces of something in it i wrap it in learn my full or something like that and then stick it in the refrigerator freezer you know because i mainly go to that so hold on guys okay honey put this
jelly beans. I'm in here about to um, make a salad. They had these little bags, a salad downstairs, Nashville hot mini chop kit. So I'm going to um, go ahead and make this. I got the eggs boiling. They should be done. And um, also, I grabbed the bag of um, hot sauce yeah. romaine lettuce that they had. It's the other Lord salad kit. And then they had these bags of um, kale. So I'm going to clean that later on tonight and um, put that in the freezer. I got to do the same with some of these before they go big. Clean these bell peppers and put that in the freezer. Oh, and I also got, um, um, what is it? Uh, Parmesan cheese. They had that down there too. And, um, that go Bridget, y'all. Hi. <laughs> and also, sis got some too. She got the, one of these, and then she got the garden, bigger garden salad. The greens. Oh, yeah. And I forgot they had the broccoli florets. I got two bags of these. I put them in a uh, deep freezer. They had bananas. They still got a lot of bananas down there. These Bridget's and these mine's over here. And she also got the um, cornbread. They only had three of these. So, yeah. That's what we got that they had down in the building. So... Yeah, and it was only three bags of the greens. The other lady, she didn't want a bag. So I got, that's how I wound up with two bags. So yeah, I'm just sitting here making my, um, here we make my little salad or not. Did honey just say he was going there? Oh, he just took the paper butt out for a walk. I forgot. I thought he was going. Um, I guess I don't think the clothes finished yet. But yeah, this how the salad look. Ah, uh, we are so hungry, guys. And this is the little pack that was in there. Oh, this is a hot pack. I don't know what this is. Let's see. Romaine lettuce and dill pickle. Seasoned crispy cucumbers with creamy Nashville hot ranch dressing. Okay, this creamy Nashville hot ranch dressing. That's what this is. And I guess this is the... I don't know what this is. Oh, crispy... Cucumbers, dill pickle salad with crispy cucumbers. So that's what this is. I don't know if I'm a I'm a taste the ranch thing and see if I if I like the hot the hot spicy um, ranch. Oh, the dill pickles. This one tastes good. Let me taste one. Oh, that tastes good. I like that. They got a pack of little crispy dill pickles in there, sis. Oh, okay. I don't know how this ranch gonna taste. This is probably good too. I'm gonna taste a little bit. Oh, you got two different kind of salads mixed together? No, it says it's called um. The salad dressing they have in here is creamy Nashville oh, hot. Oh, salad dressing in there? Yeah, it's a little pack. It's oh. creamy Nashville hot ranch dressing. Oh. So I'm going to taste a little bit on my hand to see if I like it. Oh, this tastes good. I'm glad we got two packs because I know honey ain't going to um want to eat on it. I should have got um some more of those salad. When I go back down, I'm going to see if they got any more of them little bags of salad. I know. I, they probably I, gone by now, though. Yeah. This is good. Oh, yeah. And I never heard of this, so now I can look for them, the hot, creamy ranch in the stores. I like it. Oh. 
I got a piece of lunch meat, sis. You want me to save you a piece? No. No. All right, guys. I'm going to, um, this little lunch meat that I had, I'm going to save one. If there's only two little pieces left. So I'm going to save one for, um, when I eat my other salad. Huh? Just a nice, quick little brunch. This is right on time. We was sitting here and kept opening up the refrigerator. I told sis, I said, you hungry too, ain't you? I said, because you keep doing the same thing I'm doing. Open up the refrigerator. <laughs> hold up, baby. Hold up. Uh, only thing it wouldn't know cheese. I don't know if I want to put some cheese in here or just eat it like that. I'll probably just eat it like that with my egg. My egg should be done too. <coughs> I'm gonna run some cold water. What you need, honey? Oh, I'm just looking at, looking at, looking at, looking at. Uh, these are nice little salads. It's good. Well, this some they got the crunchy dill. What? Yeah, I'm doing salads. I'm going to get some more. I don't know. It's still some stuff down there, though. They got the little crunchy dill in there. It's still some stuff sitting down there, though. I don't know. The hot, creamy ranch. It's about to run down there and see if there's any more salads. some um cold water on sis sis eggs eggs be cooling and this how my salad looking this how my salad looking I look like I'm gonna need a little bit more um dressing though bit of my um um restaurant style Italian dressing dressing Tuscan Tuscan garden I'm just gonna add a little bit I don't need a lot of it
Let me get my cup because I'm going to pour me some water. I'm going to sit down and eat my lunch. Right, jelly beans so i'm gonna go ahead and close this vlog out and um i know it probably wouldn't that long but it was something um yeah and before i close it out i just want to say thank you so much genie um genie collins for the paypal thank you so much i really appreciate it god is good that is that was right on time lovely uh the last time when you said something it was on time too so look at god thank you jesus and i really appreciate it all right guys and i also wanted to tell y'all um let me go in here i know my time is almost up with this um p.o box and because i think it's just for um three months guys it's a hundred dollars for three months and my time is almost up with the p.o box i don't think um i'm gonna pay another hundred dollars um because i got the p.o box and you know everybody was uh, a couple of people kept asking that i have a p.o box and since i had it um I haven't received anything, so I don't want to waste another hundred dollars on paying for another three months. And also the jelly beans that helped me out with getting the P.O. box, you know, um, I don't want to waste anybody money and stuff like that. So I feel bad about that. But anyway, yeah, I just wanted to say that. So I don't think I'll be keeping it for another um, 
paying a hundred dollars for another three months because that's just you know wasting money but um anyway thank you guys it was a thought that count and i really appreciate everything that you guys um do i really appreciate y'all you know just watching the vlogs and that helps me out as well so i do appreciate everything that you guys do i just wanted to update y'all about the p.o box so, all right, lovies, um, let me know what y'all think about that. And, yeah, y'all have a blessed day. And I'll be coming back soon with um, a dinner vlog. So, yeah. All right, guys, I love you. Goodbye.